My name is Sergei Putvinsky. I work in ITER in Fusion Science and Technology Division. And I want to tell a few words about plasma in general. Once I was very impressed by words of famous American physicist Feynman, who said, if by some reason all the knowledge will disappear and he has only one phrase to transfer to the future generation, he would say that all matter consists of atoms which are in a constant motion. And indeed it is. And if the temperature is not very high, then that, these atoms clump together and form solids, like this desk, for example. If temperature goes up, the motion becomes stronger and stronger, and eventually solid become liquid and a gas. And if temperature goes even further, then the collision becomes so violent that the atoms themselves break into the pieces, electrons and ions. These pieces are charged, which change property of the gas significantly. And gas becomes a plasma. Fusion wants to use a nuclear reactions between light ions. And to achieve that, one needs very high temperatures. This temperature is even higher than on the surface of the sun. Fortunately, plasma can conduct electrical currents and can be controlled by magnetic and electrical fields. And it is used for plasma confinement in the devices such as tokamaks. It's used also for heating plasma and control of the temperature. If this project will be successful, then we all will have access to very abundant uh, energy source.